I awoke to a sound outside. I crept to the window to see. The barn door was flung open by the wind and now repeatedly swings open and shut. Slam, slam, again and again. I wonder if the horse is okay. Should I check? The wind will die down soon. The barn door slams again. Suddenly, I hear another door slam. This time it came from downstairs. No one else is home. They haven't been for years. The nearest neighbor lives a mile away. I shoot a look at the clock. The power is out. Fear is released from my primal base and runs breathless up my spine. The wind blows. The barn door slams. Heavy footsteps move across the floor downstairs. Slowly. The door from the kitchen into the hallway creaks open. Footsteps move. The kitchen door slams. The barn door slams. Footsteps are now at the bottom of the stairs, ascending the stairs. With each fall of a footstep, the barn door slams. The footsteps reach the top of the stairs. Just outside my bedroom door, they stop. All four valves of my heart slam in rhythmic unison with the barn door. I jump deep beneath the covers of my bed. The bedroom doorknob jiggles. The door creaks open. Footsteps enter my room and stop at the foot of my bed. The sound of heavy breathing permeates the room. The barn door slams against my will. Slowly, I drop the covers to see what horrifying fate awaits me. And what I see at the foot of my bed is the horse, motionless, staring at me with a crazed bloodshot look in his eyes that says, Could you please fix the barn door? I can't sleep! Mm-hmm.